want you to know that I value the U.S. Vice President Kamala Harris pledged over $300 million in aid to Central America on Monday after a virtual meeting with Guatemalan President Alejandro Giamate. The United States plans to increase relief to the region, strengthen our cooperation to manage migration in an effective, secure, and humane manner. Harris leads the U.S.'s efforts to stop the growing number of migrants from crossing into the U.S. from the Mexico border and Central America's northern triangle countries, Honduras, El Salvador, and Guatemala. The aid targets drought relief, food shortages, and a partnership aimed at health and education. It also pledges millions of dollars towards the protection of refugees and asylum seekers. And we want to work with you to address both the acute causes as well as the root causes in a way that will bring hope to the people of Guatemala that there will be an opportunity for them if they stay at home. Guatemala's economy has been devastated by back-to-back -back hurricanes and the global health crisis, with nearly 8 million people facing hunger this year, according to the World Food Program. The two countries agreed to set up a joint border protection task force, where the U.S. plans to train Guatemalan forces. Guatemala, in return, will send a team to the U.S. to help reunify unaccompanied minors with their parents at the Mexican border. Harris has yet to speak with the leaders of Honduras and El Salvador.